Millions of particles enter the atmosphere every day. Those particles are called meteoroids until they enter the atmosphere. Then we call them meteors. The week we were writing this lesson, several meteors were spotted in Georgia and South Carolina. A weather satellite caught this image of what's called a bolide or large meteor. In the image, you see it as a bright white area, which is the distortion of ionized material in the sky. That ionized material can reflect amateur radio signals in some bands. This type of operation is called meteor scatter or meteor burst communication. HAMS also bounce signals off the moon. Send your signal off about 239,000 miles, and it comes back to Earth around 2.5 seconds later. On a good day, you might get a 750-mile contact using meteor scatter. For an EME contact, that can be up to 12,000 miles, literally halfway around the world. Hope you enjoyed this free preview of our satellite and space operations course. Visit us at hamradioprep.com to get this course, plus our other operating courses, Ham Radio Basics, the HF Masterclass, and Emergency Communications 101. And when you're ready to study for or upgrade your ham radio license, the best place to start is hamradioprep.com.